welcome back to San Jose Sharks franchise here in NHL 21 and uh, yeah we are up here in the Stanley Cup Finals and uh, you know we made a run we made a run the San Jose Sharks are in the Stanley Cup Finals for a second time in seven years I think yeah seven years yeah seven years no six actually six years and uh yup you know we're playing against the buffalo sabers another team that has been pretty much choking these last few years you know you'd always expect them to make the playoffs and they just will just play bad so if you look here as you see in this team it's nothing i have no wait Jack Eichel? Jack Eichel's scratched or what? Or just came back from injury? So they probably did it without... Okay, so... Uh, their team isn't good. At all. It's not... It's nowhere near ours. It's nowhere near ours. Defense, the first pair is good. And after that, it's pretty much it after that. It's... It's... It's, it's like... Not good. You know what I mean? It's like it's not good. It's not a goalie. Oh, they have Darcy Kemper. But you know, so goalie could be almost an even matchup. But this team doesn't impress me. It, it really does not. Compared to our team, we we have the depth. We have everything. We literally have everything a hockey you might want in a hockey team. So we should crush that team. We should completely crush them. It should end in five games pretty much, you know, but You know anything can happen. There's a reason why they're here So I'm not gonna underestimate them. Let's check the playoff stats so far with the team and as you look here Ryan Donato is leading the team in points Behind Brent Burns, Evander Kane. Lewin Kutcher is a bit underperforming to his standards. You know, he's not very, he's not playing well defensively either. But, you know, we have everything to back it up. Evander Kane and Timo Mai are playing very well. Ricard Raquel, same for him too. Uh, for goalie, Devin Dubnik's having a 930 save percentage. He, he makes a case for Conn Smythe. He makes a case for Conn Smythe there. He really does. So, we're going to check the playoff stats here. Uh, why not here? Sebastian Ajo. He's not in the Stanley Cup Finals. Okay, so the Hurricanes are out. Jack Eichel is their best point scorer. Okay. So, whatever, I guess. Whatever. Oh, wait a second. I forgot to check. Uh, I, I forgot to check. No, no, no. The team stats during the playoffs. Wait a sec. Team stats. And, uh, yeah. We're gonna check, you know, uh, what's up here? Best offense is Tampa. We're the third best offense in the playoffs. We're... We're letting in a lot of goals. I, I think more than, like, yeah, third worst offense. Oh, that's goal... F oh, okay. Goals for so, so third best offense. We have the most goals for. Uh, best defense. Third best. De oh, the Sabres have the best defense. So they're. So I don't know how they've been able to lock that uh, to lock that up. But okay. Uh, power play goals. Okay. Uh, where is like the power play percentage here? Okay. Uh. And not count these teams. Uh, I mean, the Panthers had the best power play, but they've been out in in one round. We have a ten percentage. Uh, we we have five goals. Uh, but whatever, you know, it's not it's not very gonna be accurate because like there's teams that are out. So like whatever. But uh, let's just go right into it. Okay, let's go. We start this off. Oh, two goals right off the bat in two minutes. 
Oh, two two shots, two goals. We're we're having a fast start here. Oh, as Rasmus Dalin, you know, he uh, he, you know, he he makes it a bit a bit more quiet here. You know, I'm not jumping the gun already, bro. It's, it's, it's you know, but we're having a very good start. You know, so shots are even, but we have the edge so far in in the score in the scoreboard. So that is good. Second period. Ah, oh, they tied up. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so that's the problem with having a fast start. Oh, Evander Kane. We retake the lead here. Power play, can we score? No, we don't. We give up a pen uh, power play here. And uh, we kill it off easily. Don't let it go, please. Good. So we have the lead after two. You know. Uh. There isn't a lot of shots. <laughs> there isn't a lot of shots. That, that's what I'm going to say. Teams are really shutting themselves up. Sh shutting themselves down a bit. You know, e even with goals. But it looks like there aren't much chances. Oh, we get a power play here. And it's Ricard Raquel who's going to score. Okay, so we're, we have the lead 4-2, to you know. Against the best defense in the playoffs. They've been playing very well defensively. And uh, we have the edge. In the first game, we're scoring four goals. But we have one of the best offenses in the league. They, they outshot us by five. But Devin Dubnik, you know, 933 save percentage here. Two goals for Evander Kane. Thomas Hurdle ha had himself a good night too. A, a good a good game. Timo Meyer is injured. Oh, God. We're going to have to make some changes. We're going to have to make some changes here. Uh... I'm going to put a power forward here. Power forwards don't work that much with the with team here, but it, it, I mean, you, you got to do what you got to do, you know? So I got to put up, uh, and it's pretty much it. I think it's pretty much it what I have to do here. Uh, let you know Sunfist, okay? Uh... Extras. Uh, I, I'm gonna put back. Uh, you know, I'm gonna put. You know, I'm. I'm gonna put Sanford, and I'm gonna put back Timo Meyer after that. But yeah, we have the one nothing series lead here. That's what counts. But Timo Meyer is gonna. He, he's gonna be a big loss in the quick time. Uh, uh, in the quick sim here, he's gonna be a big loss. But uh, we have the players to still do it. You know. I haven't even checked for how long he's been. He's out. Two power plays already. Come on. Be disciplined. We only have one shot. Okay. We have three. Okay. Uh, three, two, one. Don't let in a ball breaker. Just at least that. Okay. Good. Quiet period, but they've been dominating. It shouldn't be like that. You know. I mean, it looks like their defense is really for real. Like, we're not getting much chances at Derek Brassard. And, and we don't have the defense to do anything here, so to really shut down. We have a couple of defensive defensemen and a couple of offensive defensemen. But, you know, oh, come on, score a goal maybe? Oh, God. Timo Meyer missing is, uh, is is big. It's big here. Come on. Uh, please. Oh, my God. Rasmus Dahlin. I mean... With how it is, like, am I really surprised? Am I really surprised that, that, like, we're getting shut down, you know? Am I really surprised? Not that much. But, uh, look. Shut out. Two to nothing. That, that's not what we want. Not what we want here. Really not. Uh, Logan Couture, we need you to produce. Game three at Buffalo. I'm not gonna make changes quite yet, but if there's a bad offensive game again, I'm gonna have to make changes. As Reinhardt scores, Evander Kane is gonna score after that. Okay, Evander Kane, bro, he's he's making a case for Consmite. He's making a case for himself too, you know. So really good. Hopefully we don't let in a goal before the end of the period. Okay, good. Okay, uh, we've been, okay, oh, nice play here, Thomas Hurdle, 
Thomas Hurdle, Oscar Sunfist. So three to one, we take the lead. We have the lead now. Four to one, Thomas Hurdle with with his second goal of the game and the period. So, oh, another power play. Can we score? No, we don't. <laughs> Shots are still close, even with the score being a bit uh, out of hand. But yeah, uh, we just went off in the second period. We just went off. I have no clue what the uh, bro. It's uh, it's something else. I still haven't seen Logan Logan Couture though. You know, like at least pad up your stats. Like at least do that. Like come on, bro. I haven't seen you in a while. Okay. Uh, no. Oh my God. Are you kidding me? But yeah, uh, Eric Carlson's gonna pad up his stats five to one, and it's gonna be a two one series lead here. So. There's a big difference between a 3-1 series lead and a 2-2 series tie. I say that every time. But we're a lot of these times in, in, in these situations, you know? But we've always found a way to win the series after that, you know? So, I'm not going to make any changes. All good. We have the lead. I'm not going to panic right now. But, yeah. Come on, add Buffalo. It would be heartbreaking here. We get both wins on the road. Come on. Again, we're leading in the shot column. Four. Okay. Uh, Ali's only going to go power play. Can he score? No. Okay, so... I'm... I mean, we're dominating them right now. It's, uh... I'm, I'm still satisfied. I'm satisfied because we haven't let in a goal and we're really dominating the shot the shot totals hopefully we it, it goes in and it does let you know of in a very weird angle not gonna lie but oh on power play we don't score we're completely dominating them in the shots though 23 9 they don't even have 10 shots okay let's go they're taken let's go and uh casey middle side is gonna is not a good goal to let in. I, I I don't like I don't like that. I really don't. It shouldn't be uh it's with one minute left, it's it's a ball breaker. It's a ball breaker. Come on. Power play right off the bat, we don't score. Um I mean we're still dominating. It would be it would be sad if we just don't win this game in regulation or we just lose it. Come on, five minutes. Come on, it would be a good goalie win here. Let's in one goal. Let's go. And we score uh, in the empty net here. So it's it's a nice goalie win. I mean... <laughs> Devin Dumnik, again, he's been playing very well. I mean... Darcy Kemper had himself a good game too. You know, he, he let in two goals. It, it's, it's not his fault. Timo Meyer's back at the right time. So we can end this series right now. We can just end it right now. Uh, who was there? Uh, it was Letunov. I think that was Letunov. Wait a sec. I, I'm pretty sure that was Letunov. But yeah, what, whatever. Uh, put it back like it was before. Okay. Uh, and have it like it was. Okay. Um. What a sec. What did I see? Okay. Oh, oh, whatever. Whatever. Uh. Yeah. Okay. So let me see if it, there's better chemistry. No. So I, I mean, both snipers. You know. So yeah. Uh, Timo Meyer is he back in the? Yeah, he's back in here. And uh, yeah, you know. No lineups are messed around with. So, so that's like a good thing here, you know. It, it, it's a good thing. It's a, it's a pretty good thing here. Uh, we're going to try to end it here. You know. Okay, come on. Game number five in front of our fans. Expect Buffalo to just come out strong. You know, because it's... It, 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 it's reality, you know. It's reality. They have to win this game, or else it's 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 done. It is it, it is done. So come on, shots are pretty even. Don't let a ball breaker a ball breaker. That's good. Devin Dubnik has been playing so well for us. 
has been playing so well. Early power play, can we score? No, we don't. Come on. Buffalo, okay. We don't, uh, nothing else happens here. Okay. Uh, sh shots are still even. Can we score? Like, come on. Logan Couture is, hasn't been here the entire time, bro. Haven't seen him. At all, man. Haven't seen him do, do, do shit. You know? Come on. Third period, it's 0-0. Zero, zero. Who can come up? Oh, no. It's a long power play. What did they just take? Oh, my God. Another power play. What are y'all doing? Oh, and, th and that's game. Oh, 2-1. to one. I I I'm stopping it. I'm stopping it here. I'm stopping it. We're hopping in right now. Here in the later stages of um, oh, whatever. Oh, uh, wait a sec. Uh, I forgot about that here. You know, uh, I'm gonna... I forgot about the controls. Wait a sec. I'm gonna select sides, yes. And... Coach mode, yes. So, here we go. We score a goal here. We score a goal. Let's see what happens. Can we tie the game? Eichel, no deke here. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, oh, good. Oh, let's go. Two on one. Two on one. Cross Curry's here. What a play. Oh, my God. Timo Meyer tried. Give it back to... He should have shot. He should have shot. It was a nice play, though. It, it was a nice idea, but, it, it, you know, it's, it's Donato. He's, he's, not a, he's not known for his scoring ability or his finishing ability. So, Meyer, you, you should have shot that. I think it should have been a shot. Even though it looked, it would have been beautiful if it uh, if it went in. Okay, come on. Uh, we gotta we gotta do something here. We really gotta do something, bro. I'm here to pull the goalie. I'm I'm getting ready to pull the goalie. We gotta. Okay, pull the goalie now. Come on, Evander Kane. Okay, to Meyer. Oh, let's go. Couture shoot scores. And Logan Couture scores an important one here. Third goal of the playoffs, and what a play as we pull the goalie. And I don't know what the Sabres were doing. And what a play. Look at this, another replay here. Booth, forehand, backhand, forehand. Simple move. Pretty simple move, I don't know. Come on, coach of uh, of Buffalo. I have no clue why you're putting Ristol Linden on the ice in a situation like that. And look, it caps off. Coming off the bench also, you know, I, I made the call here. Okay, so we're most likely heading to overtime here. Unless something happens, Couture with two goals. With 12 seconds left. Logan Couture. Oh my god. What a play. And we're 12 and all of a sudden we're 12 seconds away from winning the cup. What a heartbreaker. What a heartbreaker. And it's Rasmus Dahlin, yeah. Like it's us exposing your best defenseman. <laughs> Logan Kutcher scores the probably the most important goals of his career at the age of 33. He's, he scored important ones, but it has to be his most important goal of his career because this one will mo will win them the Stanley Cup. That's for sure. And really no way they're going up the ice like that. I have no clue why he's dumping, but it doesn't matter. We win the Stanley Cup. What a story, you know. In what? Year number two. Year number two, we win the cup. And, uh, you know, I, I really don't see how this rebuild is really hard after all. It's an old team, yes, but we can always get younger. There's always a way to get younger here, you know? But look at this. The other team hoists the cup. Ah, uh, disappointment. Best defense, my ass. You just got exposed. Exposed.
completely because that's how it is you know that that's how it is i don't think you can yet it's a kick in the pants to get this far and come out empty handed so let's go and uh all that thanks to logan couture who just decided that hey it's gonna be his best time Bet Dubnik, well deserved. Well deserved. I've always noticed that the player he, that he has, he's insane. Is always a he's insane. Because it's such a team win. Insane. The Cup, of course, that the feels it's a. Uh, awkward in this spot. It's also huge. It is what it is, person. man. <laughs> and. And He's here's the captain the here, Stanley the Cup. one who stepped up late in this game, right now. Logan Couture. It, it must be an amazing feeling. Every time and, I see uh, hoist the cup year after year, I feel a little pain. He lifts it here at the age it. of 33. What a great so literally at the end of his prime, oh, he lifts it, gives it up here to, to Thomas Hurdle. Like. He's still a young guy, he's still a young guy. And it must be such you know, he's he, he's to, to be here. Trophy, to realize this is it. This is what he's I to be here for. before you know longer than than most players here. Oscar Sunfist. I'm pretty sure he came here as a rental. Traded him. I'm pretty sure we traded for him in the trade deadline. I'm pretty sure we did. Or we, yeah, I'm pretty sure we picked him up in the in the trade deadline and. Uh, like you know I EA I still don't like the fact that you're just giving it to fourth liners before the goalie like like we can like I think we should be able to choose who to give it to yeah but okay you know Devin Dubnik he's the guy who deserves it the most he's the guy who deserves it the most it would have been disappointing if he didn't and we don't even choke you know we're the number one seed in the NHL. We're the we're the best team in the NHL in the in the regular season. It's pretty rare to see. It's pretty rare to see some you know the best team in the league actually win the cup. You know, winning the President's Trophy. It's it's it, it's pretty much a curse. But we just proved how much it wasn't. Devin Dubnik, 939 save percentage, played a great game too. And Logan Couture, two goals in the last minute. And what a what a slapper. What a play. Look at this. And Ricard Raquel finishes up with the most points. You know, with the most points. What we're going to do here before we end it here. Sim to like, you know, a month. You know, like for the... What is that? I'm gonna check. Uh, I'm gonna quick check here if my sliders are still. Yeah, I, I always have to check because sometimes EA can just reset everything. But yeah, uh, what we're gonna do here? Put penalties back four out of four, just so that I don't, uh, I don't forget. Uh, auto rotate goalies back on, and yes, playoff settings are are off now because the playoffs are done. We won the cup, and uh, only in our second year. All in our second year, San Jose wins the cup. The Calder Cup goes to the Pittsburgh Penguin affiliation. So that is a, a good thing here. The salary cap, I think it goes... It went up, right? Yeah, it, it goes up every time anyway. So let's sim a few days here. Sim a few days. So what we're going to try to see here, the contracts who need to be signed, the players who need to be signed, we need to re-sign Ricard Raquel. We still got the extension, you know, the extension dollars. We have 11, oh, he's asking for big money. He's asking for big money. For four years? Does he want to come back? Yes, he wants an extension. I could give him four years. 
I really don't know about that. I don't know. I, I might as well just... Out of all these guys, he's probably the only one who I would just bring back. But, you know, Blitzfield. He's pretty young, so I'm going to bring him back here. Is there anybody I want to bring back? Geki? Okay, yeah. Uh, you, uh, you, you can come back here. And... You have a bunch of these 20 year olds. Eh, you know, he's top 9. I'm not gonna bring them back. Same thing with these guys. Like, there's literally nobody I wanna bring back. Like, if you look at it, 26. Oh, let you know, I would, I would probably wanna bring back. Oh, you're taken. Same thing with you. Yeah, I'm gonna bring back your taken. You know, I, I, I kinda like you, so. I'm gonna bring it back. Uh, let you know if I'm gonna try bringing you back to two mil. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna. Uh, uh, I'm signing you after. I'm gonna probably qualify you. Most like, most likely, Gambrel. What do you want? Three mil. So I'm gonna try taking care of uh, of Raquel first. Uh, seven point five for three years. That's how it's gonna be. I'm, you know, I'm just gonna see. It's it's right before ending it, so whatever. Geki decided to to resign. What's up with Raquel? Okay, that's good. Raquel. Oh, he accepted. Seven point five for three years. So that is. Eh, I don't know. He's asking for a lot of money, but you know, he's he's produced in the playoffs. Like, look, he he's produced. But, you know, whatever. It, it's pretty much how we're going to end it here. So, subscribe if you're new. Click the like button. Comment all what you think. And, yeah, guys. Next episode, next episode is going to be the draft. So, we probably have many things to rethink of. You know, because we have... Contr I mean, we, we really... I mean, our best players are going to be... Are still locked up for long term. But, you know, I, I think it's like it's more cap management wise you know but oh shit wait a second yeah we need to bring back our guy here we, we need to bring back Dubnik oh I forgot about this guy oh he wants a, he wants what what does he want oh he wants 4.7 for two more years I, I don't, okay, you know what? I'm gonna, you know, I'm, I'm doing one year. I, I'm gonna do one, one year because at any time you might decline. Okay, like I'm not, I'm not gonna jump the gun too, too early here. Okay, you want us a cup, but come on, he, he resigned by the way. But it's, I mean, you're, you're 36. You know, you're, you're 36. So yeah, we're going to end it here, you know. See you guys in the next one.